let me show him. You press circle, oh my god. It's beautiful. Press circle again. Oh shit, complex as hell. Let's do it. Now, granted, we didn't need to go here, but we wanted the platinum boat, baby. And yes, I remember it is platinum. Titanium is Ratchet 3. It's gold bolt in Ratchet 1, platinum bolts in, pl in Platinum 2, in uh, Ratchet 2, and titanium bolts in Platinum 3. God damn it, Ratchet 3. And then I think after, I think for a little while, no, I think for a while in the future series it was just gold bolts. Thank you. So now, for the most part, we're done with Uzla. For the most part. Because if you can see, you know, uh, wait, is it help? No? Oh, special. Duh. Skill point wise, I think there's only one, right? The one that I just said? Yeah, just shoot. Oh, no, no, no. Smash and grab, too. Forgot. Yeah, that should be it for here. And then. We can't see it now, but there's a. Uh, <laughs> There's a few, there's there's a lot more things here. Like if you saw that ramp that I was at when I was trying to look for like that little bottle that I had already shot, we'll have to come back there. And there's just so much shit we can do. But that's for later. Fuck you, box. We Lego. Yeah, see, we're still missing a platinum bowl. We're still missing a bunch of stuff. So till then, let us go on. To the Maktar Resorts! Oh crap, I'm getting hungry. It's 10.20 a.m.? Okay. I guess this is what you call breakfast time. Clank Senpai noticed me. I said. No thief done or Yamate. Don't do that to Clint. How dare you? You scoundrel. Alright. So, this is uh, where it's going to get kind of annoying. Welcome to ship combat. I, now, I do love this. Can you get out of my face now? Thank you. Just collected raritanium. Raritanium can be traded for ship upgrades. As you can see, uh, this this... I thank you, Martial Law. Somebody has texted me. Probably my mom. Again. But, um, yeah, th your ship is under attack here, and there's two waves, okay? Now, you actually can't, uh, you can't actually die by running into, like, some of these rocks out here, so I would shoot all, the yes. I would shoot all the ones that I could shoot. Plus, you get rare titanium, and that helps ship up great. Stop it! Stop shooting me. Now, the worst part here is this isn't easy. Like, you act, you, I remember when I first played this, I died a couple times, for, actually. One time because I had, like, run into a rock, like one of these asteroids here. Stop it! Another time is just because I took too much damage. Because I didn't necessarily know how barrel rolls worked and shit. I was like, what the fuck is a barrel roll? Because I didn't play no Star Fox 64, goddammit. Now, see, the other issue here is. The, the AI is like programmed to get behind you and blast your ass. Damn it. That's why you keep, you keep getting shot up. And it's actually good that I got a partial shield. Problem is, I don't have the upgrade that increases my shield. And honestly, I would rather... It, 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 it's the, the best idea is... Oh shit, we've done. Cool. The best idea is to just keep holding down the fire button. Because you never know when they're going to pop up in front of you. And you want to already go ahead get, you know, get a chance to blow their asses away. Also, you have missiles. God. Now, see, the worst thing that can happen here is, you see what just happened? See how my shield disappeared? He ran into me. That actually can't, you can collide with the ship, and they will run into you. And, you see, now I'm on my last little bar. Stop it! I'm on my, I'm on my actual ship health now, instead of my shield. The best thing you can do is either get a partial shield or full shield when this happens. But it's random. So you might not, <laughs> and if they do like they did to me, which is run into me, stop it, goddammit. If they run into me, and hopefully you don't have to see it, but if, the, if it does happen, 
it takes a humongous chunk out of your ship. Like right now, it would probably reduce my ship to like a third of its health if it, if I ran in if somebody ran into me. Die, please. Where's the last one? Where are you? Where? I know you're here, especially since you're shooting at me. There we go. Enemy fighters defeated. Proceeding to the Maktar Nebula. Cool. I'm just gonna keep doing this until you just. Oh shit! Oh, I don't know if you die there. I I don't know if you die there if it counts. But I wasn't trying to find out. It scared the hell out of me. See, that's the other thing. Like, you might not see the asteroid coming. You just, you just walk in and then boom. Done. Lordy, lordy. So. There is a skill point here. For similar to, like, the other one. Where you can break every damn thing. And get a skill point. Um, I am gonna do it. Don't get it twisted. But I'm gonna do it a bit later. Have some of that. Have some of that. One shut the fuck up. Not gonna go there yet. But yeah, as you can see, there's a crap load of shit to break here. Just so much crap. Oh wait, I should probably get some ammo shit now. Do I need it? Oh no, we straight. Well then, onward. Suck it. Suck up. Suck it all. I love the name of these little robots right here. I think they're called chicken bots. I, mm, I don't necessarily see chickens, but god damn it. The word chicken and bot. Like, bot just sounds like a funny word in general. So when you add chicken, which is a kind of hilarious word itself. Like, like, there's certain words you can just chain together and it'll be funny regardless of what you say. You know, chicken, bot, chicken bot, it's fucking hilarious, it's gold. Waffles, Waffles is like the king of hilarity. Which is why Teen Titans Go decided to have a whole fucking episode about fucking Waffles. Yeah, I tried to watch that show. Goddamn. <laughs> Goddamn 47, that was just no. That was 20 types of no. I can't fuck with that show, man. But if you like it, hey. Do what you do. I'm just not fucking with it. Can't co-sign it. Oh, y'all ain't give me no chopper rounds? I got you. I'm gonna go use this gravity bomb real quick. Get the bomb, get the bomb. Oh, I remember now. Uh, the, uh, the, uh, the useless podcast. I'm gonna spoil it a little bit. In case you do watch it. They had... <laughs> There was like a little episode on this part. What's good, Nyoko? Bye bye. They had a little part episode where they got to this part, and it, it's like one of the dudes was like he was cringing because he he worked on this part specifically. And he, when they did the like the play testing, they were talking about how the kids couldn't they couldn't figure out to take the little robot and throw his ass. Oops. Well, fuck it. Let's go for it now while we're here. Yes, there's a skill point for this as well. Skill points all around. First, let me kill all these guys in case they decide to... In case they decide to get brolic and try some shit. Aw, oh, damn it. Too far. Now die. But yeah. Uh, yeah, the kids for... The kids couldn't figure out how to... Or figure out that you had to... Because you see how it's got these, these floor panels, right? Where it's like, hey... Oh, I shouldn't have did that shit. But, um, it's like, hey, this is where, you know, you, you, there's big feet here. And Ratchet doesn't necessarily have big feet, but he does. So, and I ain't gonna lie, it, this did confuse me when I first played it. I don't know if I, like, just straight up gave up, but it did confuse me enough to make me kind of just, like, sit and think for a minute. But, you know, again, it, it it's just a matter of you piecing shit together. I mean, I wasn't necessarily... I didn't play... Oh, shit. Aw. I didn't play Ratchet <clears throat> 2 until... Because my aunt bought it for me. It, it, okay. My aunt bought Ratchet 2 for me after a summer... Summer. After where we used to live, where it was a lot more projects... Or not projects, but more ghetto. And we got our house broken into. So I lost... All my games, all my games, all my systems. 
Well, except for my Game Boy Color, because I actually had that in a closet, and they just kind of came in and took whatever the fuck was out. That's why I stressed to my brother so hard, like, yo, don't leave your shit out, dude. You never know. I know it's like we're not in the same neighborhood, and he wasn't even, he wasn't even, like, was he alive? No. He wasn't even born then. But still, like, you, you never know who might come kick in the door. Even though we live across the street from some Asian people who, like, always have the garage open, dude. Like, they always got the garage open sipping beers and shit. I'm like, yo, that, that shit seemed fun as hell. They some old dudes. But anyway, um, yeah, so I, I, my aunt got the game for me, and it, 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 it I, I spent, like, god damn, oh shit. Okay, when you see it turn red like that, it might explode. Come on, man, where my luck at? Well, I mean, I guess I'm getting lucky because I am getting money, but shit. Let me get the three bars, fam. This shit could take a while, so I guess while I'm doing this. But yeah, uh, she got the game for me, and I don't remember how old I was when I played it. God damn, I'm getting thirsty. I don't know how old I was when I played it. I want to say I was like maybe 12, 13. No, I was more than 12, 13. Because I was like 12, 13 when I left Florida. So, I don't know. I was middle school, high, almost high school. Yeah, well, no, not high school. I was like probably fifth grade to middle school. Because I, I, I lived in that those apartment complexes, some ghetto-ass apartment complexes. I lived there from like fifth grade to s part of seventh grade. So, there was that. And I don't remember how old I was. I don't feel like thinking about it. I'll put it in the fucking annotation. But, uh... Or annotation. You know what I mean. God damn! Come on, fam! I mean, I am getting ammo back, so I can't even trip. But shit, man. Alright. Stop playing with me, fam. I'm just gonna start smacking the shit out of you. Actually, no. Not a good idea. Better to just stand from afar and do it. Because eventually, the red thing... I'm surprised it hasn't even blown up on me yet. I'm getting money right, damn it, now. But, uh... I, so it didn't... It wasn't really that hard for me to figure this out, but it... I remember in the useless podcast thing, they said that these pads weren't here. It was just kind of like... It just had the little slingshot thing, and it didn't really show you where to throw him. So I can see how kids would get confused about that, but like it, it, it was it, it's an interesting. Oh shit! Yup. Good night, bitches. That was a fucking waste of time, but damn it, that's kind of just how this skill point works. It's all about luck. <laughs> this is why I don't gamble, cause my luck is terrible. Hellie blood. Like I did, Like my my luck is so bad that when I play Pokemon games. I get hit with a critical, right? It's like, alright, that was bullshit, but whatever, it's part of the game. So I heal it off. Then I get hit with another critical, and it's like a high roll critical. So now that critical pretty much one-shots me. 